survival. A local woman thought she was a goner when she spiraled out of control during a skydive jump. And she tells our Cole Miller, horses helped save her life. On this leg, it was from the knee down, breaking the tibia and fibula. Her body took a real beating. And then the more bruising and some over here and swelling. Nicole Crandall trading in her wings for a wheelchair. However I landed, you know, fraction left or right, I could have been paralyzed. It was a little more than two weeks ago, September 5th, Crandall was skydiving out at Eagle Creek. And you're no stranger to skydiving, right? It was my 82nd jump. Uh, it was the 20th of the season. With one jump down, she decided to go again. My understanding is that I packed it wrong. She's talking about her parachute. They want me to pull it 3,500, so that's what I did. It deployed, but her right brake, which is used for steering, was out of reach. I was trying to reach up, and I was just fixated on it. That's when she says she let go of her left brake for one last try, and at this point... As I let go, it sent me into the spiral down to the ground. Crandall says it was too late to try for her reserve, that spiral taking her down 50 feet to the ground. I remember laying on the ground and um, everybody trying to say, stay awake, stay awake. And this is the nearby field where Crandall had her crash landing. The horses you see out there, well, some say they helped save her from being hurt even worse by stepping on that parachute to prevent her from blowing away. She had to be life flighted away. There goes Nicole. I did the best that I could, and it wasn't enough. Jessica Hoops has been by her side since that day and says Crandall should be back on her feet in less than a year. She's got so much fight in her. I don't know if she'd make half the progress that she's made so far if she wasn't the fighter that she is. And A fighter who one day says she'd like to jump one more time. I could have died, you know, and here I am, alive. In Eagle Creek, Cole Miller, Coin 6 News.